hey guys this is Mutibi Maxon here and when I was making the uh, the Zeon Racing steering wheel review which you can check out in the description below or I'll put the link at the end of the video I told you I'll make a, a review of the NVIDIA's GeForce GT710 a X8 PCI graphics card uh, there are not a lot out there it's not easy to find an X8 graphics card and uh, this is a pretty good card because I've been using it for uh, light gaming and uh, as you I, as you saw in the videos I uploaded before this uh, of my nephew playing is it yeah is it yeah it was that three and you can also check that out from the link in the description and I'll put the link at the end of the video as well and at uh, when I was playing that, it was at around 50, yeah, it was from 50, the lowest weather was 50, and the highest was 60. So it was around 58, 59, yeah, there, at medium settings on 720p. Uh, so there's not much to it. It's a pretty tiny card. It's the tiniest card I've ever seen. It's like the palm of my, it's like the palm of my hand. Uh, it has three display port. It has three display outputs. It has VGA, HDMI, and DVI D1, I guess. Yeah, DVI D1. Uh, it has its own fan, and it's a pretty silent card. It doesn't make a sound. Uh, I think that's pretty much it about it, and it has. Yeah, it has X PCI X supports PCI X eight with two point oh, and apparently it has two gigs of RAM, as you can see, two gigs of VRAM DDR three. Uh, it has a sixty four bit bus. Um, okay, okay. There are some other features on the box here. It has NVIDIA physics. NVIDIA Adaptive V-Sync, it has NVIDIA FX AA and supports three displays, we already know that. And it also has direct, it supports DirectX 12, which is pretty amazing because it's like the, really the most recent DirectX version. And what else could I say about this graphics card? Uh, it's not pretty bad, but if I was to buy a graphics card, I would buy an X, X16 card because they are faster and uh, more powerful. Uh, but I bought this for my server project, but apparently it hasn't worked in my server yet. I have contacted IBM, but I'm going to have to call them back because they haven't called me back yet as they promised. So uh, I think this will be it, guys. So if you want to see how this performs on games, you can leave a comment down below. I would make some gameplays of a few games that I have. I have apparently about about 15 games. Like I have Legend of Korra, Far Cry 3, Need for Speed, Rivals, Need for Speed, Most Wanted 2005, 2012, Hot Pursuit. have Need for Speed. I have uh, Aero Track. I have that two that three have lots of games i have uh, just cause two i have plenty but i can't remember they all of them right now i have mx versus atv reflex i have plenty of them i just don't remember uh, okay guys so if you haven't subscribed to my channel, subscribe to my channel yet. And I want you to tell me how I did in my in these reviews because I have never reviewed anything before. And I want to know if it was terrible and I should not include reviewing stuff on my channel or if I should make more reviews about stuff. And I think that's about it, guys. So you can leave a comment down below if there's any question you want to ask. Uh, subscribe to my channel, request a video, or if you have any technical problem or computing problem, I also make videos about that. I make videos mostly for that. 
and make sure you check out the videos in the link description below because they are awesome and see you guys in the next video